Greetings, loves. How y'all doing? It's cooking time. Let's begin on how to make my potato pie. Okay, so you're gonna crack your egg and you're gonna put it in your bowl. Throw it away. You're gonna take your evaporated milk, basically this is carnation milk, and you're gonna pour it in the bowl with your egg. This is supposed to give it the fluff and that's why you added the egg, okay? And I'm going to take the mixing, um, the mixing stuff that comes in the package with it, you know, the cheese, I guess the cheese in there, you mix the mixing powder and now you're gonna mix it. Mix, 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 keep on mixing, keep on mixing. Sorry for the mess. Continue to keep on mixing. So once you've got it mixed to where you want it, what you're gonna do now, you're gonna take your cooking spray, spray it inside your bowl, your cooking bowl, and now you're gonna put the potatoes in there after you've boiled it and everything and got it to where you want it to. So one packet was mixed with potato, right? That's what you're seeing with the creamy, how creamy it looks, and then the other pack was mixed with the carnation milk and the egg. So now you're going to add your pepper to give it some flavor. And you're just going to mix it around. Now what you're going to do is you're going to pick up your cheese and you're going to cut it, your block cheese, because that's what I use. And all you're going to do is cut it into pieces so that it can melt in between. It's your discretion on how small you want to cut it, but I like to cut mine um, small enough. Now you gotta mix it in. All you basically do is mixing and mixing and mixing and mixing until you get it comfy to where you want it. Keep mixing, keep mixing, keep mixing. Now you're gonna pour in your mixture. Excuse me. Mix it in real well. Take your cheese. I use mild cheese in my case and I put it all on the top. And I add a little bit more pepper. That's supposed to be the top layer. Now take your aluminum foil, you're gonna cover your you're gonna cover it and put it inside. Now before you did that, you're supposed to plug it in, you know, cut through it. Here's my chicken that is being basted with it that I'm cooking. And now look. So it hasn't turned brown. That was the point to keep it so it wouldn't turn brown at the top. So poke holes in it if it's cooked all the way in the middle, which I know it is. Now it's more of I just want the top to get browned. And now look, it's brown. It's perfect. I usually make it with broccoli, but that'll be another tutorial if you'd like to see that. Please press the like button so that I know you would be more interested in more cooking videos. And I hope you all enjoyed. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.